Wow, this is a must-see multimedia presentation. You've been told all your life that the Earth is billions of years old. Does this really agree with the facts of science today? The indoctrination of deep time actually does not agree with the biblical timeline of Earth history. Now, both cannot be correct, but you will quickly learn that the geology of the Earth, along with the fossil record, as well as recent biochemical discoveries of soft dinosaur tissue has essentially dismantled the evolutionary notion of deep time. Check out the evidence presented here for yourself. Learn who and what is really behind the dating of the Earth. You will be surprised that very few scientists have any clue as to how the Earth is dated. The fossils entombed within the rock strata of the Earth attest to a worldwide catastrophic rapid burial of, in marine waters. You will also learn that geologic structures around the world are best explained by a rapid sedimentation and deformation of the layers of sedimentary rocks. The evidence does not conform to millions of years of slow deposition. Now, seismologists claim that much of the damage that's been caused across Christchurch has been caused by a phenomenon called liquefaction. A couple of days ago, we had never heard of that term, but... We will also show our audience examples of the proposed missing rock formations, which you are told represent millions of years of Earth history. The problem with that, the geologic field evidence does not support this idea, thus causing the geologic time column to essentially collapse and disappear. Adding to the incontrovertible evidence is the detection of numerous fossils throughout the geologic column, which are clearly in a current state of original soft tissue preservation. I believe we've hit a nerve. I believe with the soft tissue and dinosaur bones, we have hit a nerve, uh, particularly with the old earth, uh, long age. The examples which follow here are clearly anathema to the idea of burial for millions of years, but they do support the contention of God's eternal word that the interval from creation to Christ was 4,000 years. And in the intervening years since, this planet was shaped by the ravages of a worldwide flood. 